The jungle, the thicket of the rainforest, is one of the last places on Earth where nature can still develop freely. Let's just take a look at the impressive Amazon rainforest. With an area of 6 million square kilometers, the gigantic forest area crosses the borders of nine different countries with its unrivaled biodiversity. The Amazon Basin is one of the most important habitats on the planet. More than half of all known animal and plant species are at home here. It's believed that the impenetrable undergrowth still hides countless secrets that have always been waiting to be discovered. The six remarkable jungle finds that we're going to present to you today therefore give us a foretaste of all the great mysteries that remain to be solved in the future. Before we get started, be sure to hit the like button and ring the notification bell to stay up to date with our future videos. Also, stick around until the end to learn about one of the most concerning discoveries that researchers have found so far. Mysterious Images it's the year 1999 when clearing work in the Amazon rainforest reveals an ancient secret, the existence of mysterious, strikingly large images of the Earth. In detail, these so-called geoglyphs present themselves in a wide variety of geometric shapes, such as squares and circles. Many of these ancient works are linked by straight paths. In detail, the images of the Earth extend over an area of 250 kilometers, and their origin could be dated between the years 200 and 1283 AD. Why people went to the trouble of digging such huge structures into the ground is completely unclear. What is certain, however, is that the discovery of the Amazon geoglyphs has completely shaken our previous view of history. The approximately 200 Earth images discovered are in stark contradiction to the assumption that only small settlements existed in the area at the time. The effort that went into the making of the Earth images suggests much more that we're dealing with the work of a large, coherent civilization. In fact, we find such mysterious scratching images in some other countries. In addition to the world-famous Nazca Lines in Peru, such geoglyphs were also created in North America and Kazakhstan. Divine Footprints In Hinduism, Hanuman embodies a deity who usually takes the form of a monkey. According to the myth, the supernatural being has many extraordinary abilities. Hanuman is as fast as the wind and has the power to tear out mountains. The monkey god himself is said to be as big as a mighty mountain. However, this is not always true. In fact, Hanuman is able to change his form at will. But why are we telling you all this? Well, this is because the real footprints of the god are said to be visible to this day. In order to see what this assumption is all about, we have to go into the jungle of Thailand. In fact, there are oversized footprints that are revered by the devout Hindus as Hanuman's footprints. However, such footprints can also be found in many other countries. It doesn't matter whether it's in Sri Lanka, Malaysia, South Africa, or Syria. Almost everywhere in the world, we encounter enormous footprints that simply cannot be placed in a logical context. Mara Coxie. The explorer Percy Fawcett led a truly exciting life. After the Briton had initially served as a soldier, he then learned the trade of land surveying. As a result, Fawcett was sent to South America several times by the government to map one of the last undeveloped areas on Earth. While the explorer was completing his official assignments, he learned about an ancient legend that from then on fascinated him more and more, the myth of the sunken city of Z. Some clues suggest that at some point Fawcett devoted himself exclusively to the search for the lost city. Whether he actually managed to discover the legendary ruins in the heart of the Brazilian jungle is uncertain. Percy Fawcett disappeared without a trace in the summer of 1925 and was never seen again. It's believed that the adventurer was killed along with his son by an indigenous tribe. Others, however, believe that the father-son duo was accepted into the ranks of the tribe and lived in the jungle for the rest of their lives. 
During his expeditions into the rainforest, the Brit also kept hearing rumors about a grotesque people. This is how the Maksubi Indians told of the so-called Marikoxi. It would be a group of hairy creatures whose members would eat each other over and over again. If a human falls into the clutches of the Marikoxi, they are roasted on a spit over an open fire before the flesh is ripped from the bones. On a later trip, Fawcett again learned of a strange monkey people who lived in burrows. In this case, too, it was said that the tribe members were covered in dark fur and went hunting during the night. It's said that these beings had such a good sense of smell that they were said to have a sixth sense. Later, the adventurer is said to have even met the Maricoxi in person. So, after a few days in the jungle, Fawcett and his companions found themselves on a native trail. As the men debated whether to continue down this path, they suddenly saw two figures in the distance. A closer look revealed the unusual appearance of the two strangers. Fawcett later stated that they were unusually tall, hairy men. They also had extraordinarily long arms and a grotesquely distorted forehead. Shortly thereafter, the two strangers turned and retreated into the undergrowth. Giant Amazon Water Lily Let's take a look at one of the most impressive plant species in the Amazon rainforest. As the name of the giant water lilies already suggests, the dimensions of the plants exceed all common dimensions. Typically, we find the Victoria Amazonica, the official name of the plant, in the shallow waters of the South American jungle. The visible part of the giant water lily, the so-called leaf blade, has a fabulous diameter of up to 3 meters. The style, which is below the surface of the water, brings it to a length of 8 meters. With these dimensions, the imposing aquatic plants are able to carry loads of up to 50 kilograms. However, the Victoria Amazonica only shows its bloom for two days before it wilts. Typically, the water lilies first bloom in the early evening, presenting themselves in a rich white color and exuding a sweet pineapple scent. The odor given off serves the purpose of attracting certain beetles, which are responsible for pollination. In the morning, the water lily closes, then opens its flower one last time the following evening. This time, however, it's pink in color. The flower, after being pollinated by the beetles, then sinks to the bottom of the water, where the seeds will develop and rise another day. Glass Frogs have you ever seen a strange animal that you simply couldn't understand or explain? Today, we'll be taking a look at a very strange-looking frog, often called a glass frog. This strange creature earned its name because its underside is completely transparent. From the upper half, this may look like your ordinary frog. However, if you were to take a peek at the underside of its belly, you'd be shocked to find that you can see right into its tiny body. Taking a look at the frog, you'll be able to see its beating heart, lungs, digestive system, and even its eyes. While this may seem incredibly strange, these frogs have been around for thousands of years. Though even after all this time, we don't really understand why their undersides are transparent. The most common theory is that this transparency helps them blend in with their environment, helping them to avoid predators. If they were to perch on top of a leaf or tree, the color of the plant would shine through them, making them appear to be almost invisible. If you ever find yourself in a rainforest, you may be a bit tempted to find a small frog and tip it over just to take a look underneath. However, I can't really recommend this because some of these tiny amphibians can be very deadly. Stone Balls in the 1930s, the United Fruit Company was commissioned to clear parts of the Costa Rican rainforest to make way for new banana plantations. As more and more plants fell victim to the flames, the jungle revealed a glimpse of an ancient secret long forgotten mysterious stone spheres. To date, more than 350 such objects have been tracked down. With regard to their size, however, the structures differ very clearly from one another. While some balls are only a few centimeters in size, others are more than two meters in diameter and weigh 15 
18 tons. The places where they were found proved that the production of the stone balls was by no means a local phenomenon. In fact, these are sometimes 300 kilometers apart. In general, it's difficult to determine the exact age of stone artifacts. However, based on some pottery fragments and figurines discovered next to the spheres, researchers believe the objects were made between 600 and 1200 AD. Shortly after their initial discovery, rumors spread that the stone sphere contained gold. For this reason, many of these ancient artifacts were blasted. Ultimately, the Costa Rican government was forced to legislate against the destruction of the finds. City of Giants In 2012, researchers came across a mysterious pyramid complex in the jungle of Ecuador. Until this discovery, nobody had guessed that the ancient ruins were hidden in the middle of the rainforest. Some experts believe that the relics found may actually be the remains of the lost city of giants. In detail, the mysterious building has a footprint and a height of 80 meters each. The complex is made up of massive hewn blocks of stone, each weighing an average of two tons. In contrast to conventional pyramids, however, the jungle structure does not have a classic top, but is closed off by a kind of platform. The researchers suspect that this area was once used for ceremonies and ritual sacrifices. In addition, archaeologists unearthed many other stone and pottery artifacts on the site. What is particularly puzzling is the fact that some stone tools are so heavy and large that they could not possibly be used by ordinary people. The construction of the complex and the other finds indicate that we're dealing here with the work of an unknown pre-Inca culture. The legends of the local people say that the jungle was once inhabited by gigantic creatures and that the researchers have found the former capital of this giant people. At the same time, they gave the archaeologists an urgent warning. Since such sites are inhabited by powerful guardian spirits, it's advisable to leave them alone. Lost Civilization for a long time, most researchers were convinced that the deepest regions of the Amazon rainforest are still completely untouched. However, some puzzling finds suggest that an advanced civilization once inhabited the thicket of the South American jungle and lived over a period of a thousand years. It's thanks to a sad circumstance that we were able to discover the evidence that the unknown people once left behind. The ongoing deforestation of the Amazon rainforest. The unique lifestyle of the time remained hidden from our view for many centuries. Today, we know that the former inhabitants of the rainforest left countless mysterious works behind. These are sometimes geometric structures, such as squares, circles, and lines. The age of these mysterious walls and moats is estimated to be up to 3,500 years. However, it's completely unclear who created these numerous structures, which are known as geoglyphs, and what purpose these structures served. What is certain is that comparable objects have also been discovered in some other parts of the globe. The most famous of all known geoglyphs are the so-called Nazca Lines in the Peruvian desert. So far, more than 1,500 of these unmistakable structures have been located there. In addition to the typical geometric patterns, the soil is also adorned with countless images of people and animals. While the researchers are certain that the originators of these structures came from the ranks of the Paracas and Nazca cultures, the experts in the case of the geoglyphs in the Amazon rainforest are still completely in the dark. It's very likely that countless more of these Earth structures are hidden in the previously unexplored parts of the South American jungle. The works of art may have been part of rituals or ceremonies, but we really don't know for sure. Zombie Mushroom Unbelievable but true, a mushroom capable of mind control has been discovered in the tropical rainforest. Once an ant has been infested with Ophiocordyceps unilateralis, it turns into a mindless zombie. 
But how is that even possible? First, the hyphae, as the filaments of the fungus, penetrate the head of the crawling creature. From there, the parasitic fungus makes its way to the brain, where it drastically alters its host's behavior. As if by magic, the ant then goes to a place that offers the perfect living conditions for the fungus. The insect is manipulated in such a way that it bites the underside of a leaf or the bark of a tree, only to die afterwards. In the lifeless body of the ant, the fungus can now develop new fruiting bodies and spores, which either fall to the ground or are carried by the wind to new victims. Fossil finds dating back 48 million years shows that this manipulative behavior has an ancient history. Even then, the ants had bitten themselves into leaves in an unnatural way. What initially seems both strange and frightening has exciting potential in the world of medicine. According to this, the zombie mushrooms contain some substances that could help to find a cure for tumors. Alright folks, now your opinion matters. Which discovery surprised you the most? We're already looking forward to your comments. Please give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed our foray into the world of jungle mysteries. While you're at it, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell so you'll never miss a video again. Finally, take a look at the other posts on our channel, which you can access by clicking on one of the pictures in the credits. Thank you for watching, have a great one, and see you next time.